uh, this is a question on progressions. Let's see what this says. A1 is 1 and A n plus 1 is twice A n plus 5. So each term is twice the previous term plus 5. Then 100th term equals how much? So let's just write these values. So A1 is 1. A2 will be twice of 1. That's 2 plus 5, 7. A3 is 14. 7 to the 14 plus 5, 19. A4 will be 38 plus 5, 40. Three. So A5 would be 43 into 86 plus 5, 91. Now, you need to find out how much is A100. Now, here I'm adding 6. Here I'm adding 12. Here I'm adding 24. Here I'm adding 48. So, the addition itself is a geometric progression. 6, 6 into 2, 6 into 2 square, 6 into 2 cube and so on. So, we can write it as a geometric progression. So, if I have to go from A1 to a2, I'll have to add 6. A1 to A3, I'll have to add 6 plus 12. From A1 to A4, I'll have to add 6 plus 12 plus 18. Right. So if I have to go from A1 to A100, I'll have to add 6 plus 12, so on till 6 into 2 to the power 99. 99 parts I'll have to add. Right. So let's write this. Now A1 itself is 1. So A100 will be this number. So it will be 1 plus 6 plus 12 plus so on till 6. And this will be 98. Right. <coughs> right. This is 6 into 1 plus 2 plus 2 square, right? So, and this is 6 into 1 plus 2. So, similarly, for 100, it will be 6 into 1 plus 2 plus 2 square till 2 to the power 98, right? So, if I add this, this will be 1 plus 6 into 1 plus 2 plus so on till 2 to the power 98. Now, let's add this. Uh, geometric progression first term is 1 common ratio is 2 so this will add up to 1 plus 6 into uh, 2 to the power 99 minus 1 divided by 2 minus 1 okay this will give me 1 plus 6 into 2 to the power 99 minus 6 so which will be option D minus 6 plus 1 will be minus 5 option D will be our correct choice once you get the geometric progression right your job is done that finishes this one